Hello world, welcome to Tech Blog, and you are viewing server administration tutorial series. In this video we are going to configure Broadly Compressor with Apache Web Server. So, first log in into our system, here we go and put my user pass key and good to go. Well, I am gonna open up Firefox in, and search for Broadly. And here you can see the Wikipedia link. Open up the link with a tab aside, and before going to configure in our server let's look on what Broadly actually does. You know, as per Wikipedia Broadly is a compression algorithm developed by Google and works best for text compression. Unlike gzip it compresses your sites before being sent to the client over the network. Broadly compression ratio is much higher than others compressor for example 6 megabytes file size may compress to 2 megabytes. And compression speed also much higher, Broadly is best for static content like HTML, CSS, JS file etc. Open a tab aside and search for Broadly with Apache, you will find the documentation with Apache Web Server. Also, you could find the development file at GitHub and its instructions. Well, at this point we understand that Broadly can help you to speed up your heavy website, and save your bandwidth also. And eventually, it helps optimization on SEO ranking in the competition market. So, I have a demo WordPress website, myapp1.com, placed in an Apache web server. And generally, we are going to observe its load time before and after Broadly compression. Actually, it's difficult to observe the difference in small-scale site, but it obviously works efficiently on heavy sites. As you have seen that, it took 5 to 6 seconds to load the site completely before compression. Well, now we are going to install and config the Broadly. So, in order to do that open up terminal here, and I am going to log in my remote server from where the page is serving. We assume that you have an existing web server with Apache in order to do the experiment, and if you are in a production environment then I strongly recommend you to make a backup your files before that. You can also check out this video how to set up Apache Virtual Host above here. Here you could see my virtual host config file and there is no compression algorithm right now. Escape and back to prompt and it's time to install Broadly, go ahead and type apt install Broadly and hit enter to go. So, after install Broadly, enable the module in Apache. So, type A to end mod Broadly. You need to restart Apache 2 in order to make module effective. And after done all these stuffs clear the screen. Now, open up Apache virtual host config file. Go ahead and type nano slash etc slash apache2 slash site available and then your config file. Inside your config file place cursor after directory tag and put an if module mod broadly.c and close the module. Inside if module add output filter type broadly compress, and then put your file type you want to compress. So, here you put HTML, CSS, JS etc. Now 
After that save the configuration and exit. And again, restart the Apache service in order to make effect in your website. Now open up the browser and load the page in another tab, it will be bit faster than previous. Approximately. 3 to 4 second it took to load your site now. You could check whether your Brotly compressor work or not, using curl command. So, open a local terminal and type the following command. You can see the output that content encoding broadly is working fine for me. So, guys hope this video helpful to you. Do like and share this video, and hit on subs button to get latest update. Tech blog is sign out for now, see you again. Thank you.